Okay, now we're going to look at feature selection, which means um, picking the right attributes for your model. So sometimes you'll have you know ten uh, ten different fields of data, and some of them are are useful to the to the uh, model, and some are just noise. So I've created a fake Excel data sheet, um, just a linear model with some noise and um, and some error terms. And it turns out that the y depends on x1, x3, and x5, but not on x2 or x4. Okay, so I've got these uh, betas here, and, and the beta values are, are 1 for 1 or 0, right? And so I'm going to import that data into RapidMiner. And then what you want to do is um, use the optimize selection operator. Okay, I'm going to use the brute force one for now, just for uh, not a whole lot of attributes to choose from. Okay, so hook your data, and you want to use the weights output as your result, because so that'll tell you which attributes you want to use. Uh, this is also a chained operator, so you got to go inside. Um, you're going to want to use cross validation for this one. Okay, and you're going to want to use the uh, average performance output, and hook it up to that one. Go inside there. Use your linear regression model or whatever kind of model you're using. Put it there. Okay, and then with any cross validation, you want to apply your model and performance. Okay, so we've, we've got the um, pick up your data. Check out your uh, use brute force to try all of the attributes and all combinations of the attributes, and then output the which weights the attributes you want to use inside the optimized selection. We do a cross validation to make sure that it works on missing data as well as all the data we have. We uh, reason linear regression model. It's a linear regression model uh, data set. Uh, apply the model. Check the performance. Output that. Okay. Okay, and it's selected as the attribute weights attributes x1 through 5, and it wants to pick uh, x1, x3, and x5, which is what we expected. Now, if you have a lot of attributes, you know, 10 or 100, it's going to take quite a while for the brute force guide to work. So you might want to try the evolutionary operator. So you can go to right-click your op any operator, go to replace operator, data transformation, attribute set reduction, selection, optimization, so we're going to try the uh, optimized selection evolutionary operator.